This is without a doubt the fastest way to level up your ESHL character in NHL 24. The first thing you want to do is go to the main screen, go to more, and then go to settings. From here, you're going to want to go to gameplay sliders. And then in gameplay sliders, you're going to want to adjust all the human sliders to 100 and all the CPU sliders to zero. There's a couple that I wouldn't personally touch, like the injury occurrence or the penalties, but other than that, like it should be pretty self-explanatory. So after you adjust the sliders, you're going to want to go into World of Chell. If you're watching this show right now and your screen's loading, um, well, drop a like. After waiting for the game to load, you're going to want to go to Pro-Am. And once you get into Pro-Am, which I assume you haven't played yet because Pro-Am is pretty garbage, you're just going to want to go complete these. But I'll show you what happens once you go into a game with these uh, advanced sliders. Oh, and like it's not mandatory, but I would say go on Wing because then if you just go AFK, your CPUs will just play for you and they won't have to spend a minute trying to take the puck off of you. Okay, so like for this one, it's first to three wins. So you just want to get the puck and score. There we go. And in under a minute, I just got 300 XP, which would have taken about 25 minutes in a normal game. Some of the prom games aren't mercy rules, so you just have to sit there while your computer takes on the other team's computers. But thankfully with our sliders, you can just kind of sit there and do whatever you want to do during that time. I literally haven't touched my controller since the first period and yep, we're winning, I think eight, nothing. I'm just watching this Penguins game, so. Copies literally score every time. If this video helped you level up your character, uh, sauce me a like and hit that subscribe button. And also check out my page for more NHL 24 content. Thanks.